Some school districts in our area have barely started in person instruction before having to close because of positive COVID cases. You know, just this week, the state announced that it is mandating that kids wear masks in school starting September 7th. And with cases on the rise in children, people are asking, will this mask mandate make a difference? And what about the argument that masks negatively impact a child's mental well being? And this morning, Lindsay Ward took those questions to a local expert. I spoke to an infectious disease specialist and he tells me the Delta variant was a game changer. And one of the reasons why we're seeing more and more kids getting infected by COVID-19. And as for that mask mandate, he says it is huge because most kids don't really have any other way to protect themselves. Now, when it comes to mask wearing, it is not 100% protective, but the argument that wearing one harms students' mental health is not that strong of an argument. That's according to Dr. Matthew Moffa with Allegheny Health Network, and that's because the alternative, not wearing a mask, he says, can be more dangerous for kids. And what's alarming for parents is possible their kids could be carrying the virus and not even know it. Some children show no symptoms and it's possible they're spreading it to others. That's just one reason why we're seeing the high spreading kids, but also those under 12 can't get vaccinated. Kids are not immune to this, so we're seeing the highest rates of hospitalizations in, in pediatric population in, in the entire country right now. So um, if we don't take protective measures in schools, then you're going to see tons of transmission. So that's why wearing masks are important. As for a vaccine for those younger than 12, well, it's possible we could see that at the end of the year. And besides the Delta variant, we're hearing about another variant, but just how serious is it? I'll tell you more about that and what the medical community is saying about it coming up. Lindsay Ward, KDKA News.